After a false start, KPL champions Tasca have picked up five wins in a row. The last a 2-1 win over Sony Sugar on Sunday, an indication that coach George Nsimbe's tactics are bearing fruit. <laughs> the next match is against Madhari United. Things are, however, not good for the Brewers after it emerged that one of their best players, Shafiq Batambuze, is set to leave the club for Tanzanian side Singida. I appreciate Sana Vile Omekua. We have support for the Leo. Nasikia poa hata singetaka kutoka nasikia yani nimekuwa nyumbani pia Tasca is now up to fourth on 21 points two above promoted side Kariobangi Sharks who are quickly gaining momentum in the league the team is ranked best of the four that were promoted following a string of good results they beat Bandari 1-0 on Saturday what they are doing the training is uh... A marvelous job. They are working hard in the training and uh, it's reflecting actually on the D-Day when you're playing the matches and that's why we're getting the positive results. Another team that needs a turnaround as fast as possible is FC Leopards, who have seen their fortune dwindle ever since losing 3-0 to Gormahia in the Mashemeji Derby. Ingwe have not picked up maximum points ever since. The last result, a 1-1 draw against lowly ranked Zuke Richo. Asa ni tatizo sana sana naona ni tatizo la kiakiri. Uh, mentality inabidi badilike tuwe tuwe composed tuwe na utulivu hasa tukiwepo katika nani mchezo kwa sababu bila utulivu hata maelekezo jinsi ya kucheza jinsi tunavyoelekezwa inakuwa vigumu Gormahia aged Nzoia Sugar 1-0 over the weekend to extend their lead in the table to 25 points two above high flying Posta Rangers who drew 0-0 against Nakumat Ulinzi Stars beat Moroni Youth 2-1 to stay third on 21 points Thika United are in unfamiliar territory at the bottom on 8 points, with Western Steamer 17th on 9 points. Zuke Richo and Madhari United are also part of the danger zone with 9 points apiece.